previously on Movie Man Mark. We have now adopted Chucky's very own daughter. See that little, uh, that little, uh, Ooh, ew. Yeah, I see it. Bundle of joy? Yeah. Ew. Oh, why? That's her daughter. She's beautiful! Wow! You're her uncle. Stop! Yeah. I'm the uncle? Can I hold her? <laughs> yeah, sure. Hey, what's- Be careful though, she's just a few days of old. Of course. Yeah. So I'm not gonna drop it. Oh! Look how big she is. Since she is not human, it is impossible to predict her size. Wow! Little Chuckany, I can promise you that I'm gonna be there for you as a father no matter what. Here comes the airplane. Think and wish and hope and pray it might come true. <laughs> Disgusting. I'm not your little girl anymore, so stop treating me like one. Technically, 18 days is still a baby. But I want friends my age, sort of. Friends your age can't even talk yet. You're very advanced for 18 days old. I want to go to college. Yeah, yeah well, I want to go to college. College is an optional thing. Like, Uncle Danny never went to college. Yeah, and I'm fine. Yeah, exactly. I think we should put her up for adoption. Wait, Danny. We didn't tell you? She already is adopted. Oh, you guys haven't told her yet? Wait, no, 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 wait. I haven't told her because we haven't figured out a good way to tell her yet. Oh, easy. I killed both her parents. That's true, but that's why we're not gonna- You killed her. both my parents? Oh, shit. Uh, the chances of you surviving are very slim. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Uh, now I've really lost my patience. Oh, no, Danny, man! You grab her, I grab Megan! Thanks. <gasps> Honey! <sighs> She's gone. It's my niece. She has no idea how to live. She's gonna get trampled out there. I'm gonna go save her. I'm calculating all of the possibilities, and this probably won't end well. Kid, never tell me the odds. All right, Markers, what the heck is going on? We are leaving the neighborhood right now to go find my adopted daughter, Chuckany. If you guys saw the last video, you know the whole details. Hey guys, hopefully we find her. Wait, wait, wait. Danny? Yo, what? Yo, I'll come help. You will? Yeah, I will. Dude, are you sure? I I'm 100% sure. I don't know if she really wants her uncle there. Plus, you're not really her real uncle. I'm her uncle. Okay? All right, all right, fine. All right. Well, hop in, on. hop in. Unlock it. All right, but we don't know what we're getting into here. This could be a really dangerous journey. Bro, I know what I'm getting myself into. Just go. All right, all right. Danny, look, I know we haven't found her yet, but she's gotta be here somewhere. I wouldn't worry just yet. Bro, she's gone. What do you mean she's gone? Yeah, she's gone, man! No, she's not! We gotta keep looking, okay? It's only been a few hours. Only a few hours? Dude, are you my kid too? Do I need to babysit you? Bro, I'm just trying to be realistic here, okay? I'm hungry, I haven't had water in several hours. Let's just take a break. If you haven't had water in several hours, why do you keep complaining that you have to pee? I'm a small bladder. If we go stop, it could work to our disadvantage. She could be gone just because we stopped. Would you want to have that on your conscience, man? <sighs> I guess not. She is my niece after all. What is that, a bunny? What? Oh, look. It's a bunny. A mad cute. But not as cute as Chuckany. I say we go to the nearest college, which is Sheridan College. We wait in the parking lot overnight, and then we see if there's any sign of her in the morning, okay? That way you can get your rest. Wait, we're gonna camp out where? In the parking lot. In the park, we're gonna camp out in the parking lot? Of Sheridan, yes. In this car. What's wrong with that? I'll keep the I'll keep the heat running for you, like you like you want all the time. Uh, oh, okay. All right, here we go. I'm pulling into the parking lot right now. It's not the most ideal set of circumstances, but we're gonna have to make it work. You know what? I'm in. All right. All right, let's, let's get do it. it. All for my niece. Now we just have to try to sleep. <sighs> Wait. What? what if Chuckany walks by our car and we're sleeping? Okay then, Danny, do you have any alternative suggestions? Because I can go through the night. Oh, okay. Listen, I'm just trying to help you, but if you're going to be rude, then don't worry about it. I'm you're the sleep. one that said you were tired, man. She can walk by our car and we're going to be sleeping. That's stupid. Okay, so do you want to go out on foot? No. She's probably going to have to get tired too. I'm sure she might be camping out somewhere. Or she's in college and she's probably at some party somewhere. Don't even put that into my mind. Are we even going to get any sleep tonight? Oh, you're asking if we're gonna get any sleep tonight. Are we yeah. sleeping sit sitting up? Well, we could try here. Bro, there's so much stuff in the back. This is just gonna have to do, man. <laughs> I'm her real uncle. <laughs> I just had a dream that Chuck and he yeah, was. Yeah, I know, I heard. 
All right, Markers, I know what you're thinking. This video is about to be insane. Movie Man Mark has officially jumped the shark. Well, that's okay. I'd be concerned if you thought I was surfing the shark, but in a way I am because this video is sponsored by Surfshark. Browsing the internet is part of our daily lives. I mean, you're doing it right now. So there's nothing more important than doing it safely so your private information doesn't get a shark-sized bite taken out of it. It hurts, especially when it comes to using public Wi-Fi at an airport, library, coffee shop. Those networks are like the least secure you could possibly get. But not only does Surfshark create a private encryption for your browsing needs, but there's other perks as well. For example, Scream VI is coming out pretty soon. So to get ready for that, I'm trying to inject some Scream IV into my veins. So as a Canadian using Surfshark, I can go to Netflix UK and access the original Scream. Then I can go to Netflix US and watch the TV show. And then I can go back to Netflix Canada starting in March and access the latest one. The app has basically opened me up to entire new libraries of content within this one service. And I don't have to pay anything more on my Netflix subscription. And if I don't like Surfshark, it's fine. I can just get a refund because of their 30 day money back guarantee. So Markers, I got a deal for you. If you guys want to try Surfshark. Hit the link in the description and enter the promo code MOVIEMAN to get 83% off your purchase plus an additional three months for free. And that being said, let's get back into the video. What are you doing? Bro, you, you hey! Move, man! I am! Sure. I'm on my side! You stay on yours! Bro, there's no room in this car, man! You're having your dreams and all this? Just dream that you're in a real bed, okay? That'll work. The next morning. Oh. Yo, Danny. Uh, Danny. What, dude? Dude, it's stop. daylight. It's daylight. Let's go. We have to come up with a course of action. Oh. Uh, you down? Yeah. Let's okay. Do okay. It. Good. There's many students around. I actually don't want to go there on foot just yet. So it would cause a whole scene right in front of all the students. But we do not, in fact, know if she is actually there. So I think the best course of action is for me to fly up the drone in the sky and get a bird's eye view of the situation and potentially see if my beloved daughter is there. And my beloved niece. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna throw the drone in the sky right now. All right, guys. As you can see, we are around the campus right now. I'm currently checking the premises. No sign of her just yet. Wait. Maybe I should go. Mm closer to the main building there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think we would have a better chance. Hey, does she drive? No, she doesn't drive, So Danny. why are we looking at the parking she's lot? She's 18 days old. Why are we looking at the parking lot oh, she's then? she's 19 now. Maybe she could have gone through the parking lot to the main building, but clearly I was wrong. Why would Chuckney feel the need to leave us? Like, I'm still not over it, you know what I mean? It's still pretty fresh. Why would she leave her uncle? Oh, wait, 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 do you what? see that? I think I see red hair. Could that be her? Is that her? I don't know. Maybe I should go down and fly low to the ground. I think that's her. You think so, right? Yeah. Wait, and this is Sheridan for sure. Dude, look what she's wearing. Yeah, yeah, that's what she wears. Yeah, yeah, that's definitely her. Dude, she's actually going to school right now. I can't believe she's doing this. This is taking a big step. Megan is her mom, like an AI. She doesn't need school, you know? She's already brilliant. Maybe she just wants to be more human. She's half human, half robot, no? No, she's half doll. She's adopted. Yeah. yeah. What if she's a quarter human? Like somewhere down the line. No, I think she just aspires for that. Yo, I I, I totally have to go after her. Danny, I have a very important role for you. You need to watch the car, okay? Dude, I don't want to watch the car. I want to go make sure my niece is okay. No, no, no. We're in the middle of nowhere. I didn't pay for parking, okay? I know that's your daughter, but that's my niece. Yeah, because she's my daughter, she's your niece, okay? okay. So it's more important, you know, that the parents sense. should go. That makes so sense. just stay here, okay? Okay, fine. Can you at least keep the car running so it's warm? I don't trust you. Okay. Oh, dude. Bro, come on! See ya, dude. I am well on my way to infiltrating this college. I'm gonna get my daughter back if it's the last thing I do. I need your help. Let me know in the comments if you spot Chuck. Oh, guys, it looks like there's like computer labs here. This place is crazy. Hi, what are you doing here? You're a student here? So am I. It's so weird. Dad, you're not, I mean, not dad. You're not a student here. Yeah, I totally am. I'm taking, uh, you know, the program here, the, the, the school program. Okay, name one. Sheridan program. That's the name of the school. I'm taking all the programs. Yeah, like everything. I'm a jack of all trades. Master of none. Whoa, Chuckie, like, look, we can talk this over. There's no reason for you to leave home. No reason to leave home? Are you kidding me? Your girlfriend, who's my fake mom, killed my real parents. I know, but it could have been worse. She was almost gonna kill you. Aren't you happy that she didn't? Gee, thanks for sparing my life after that. Oh, 
You're welcome, honey. I was being sarcastic. I don't have time for this, okay? I have classes, I have a new life. I, I don't want to see you anymore, just leave me alone. What? No, 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 but Chuck and he, wait. <sighs> Three hours later. Guys, there was no way I could have predicted what it would have been like to be a father. I got thrown into this whole thing so spontaneously. I don't want to admit it, but I kind of get where she's coming from. You know, at a certain point in your life, you want your own freedom, this and that, but. Guys. I'm oh, no, no. To leave me alone. Wait a second. You're wearing their merch now too? What happened to the Child's Play merch? Everyone loves that merch. People like all around the world want it. No one really cares about Sheridan. This is my new life, okay? That stuff was childish. I know, but this is a parent's nightmare what you're putting me through. Next you're gonna tell me you have a boyfriend too? Well, I am talking to someone, but it's not official yet. Oh my god. Yeah, he actually bought me this shirt. What? You're wearing, how long has this been a thing? Well, I met him this morning, so it's been like half a day. You're dating someone you just met half a day ago? This is insane. I think your mother would have something to say about this. You met? Wait, Megan? You brought her? No, 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 listen, I didn't bring her. She showed up by herself, okay? I have no idea why you're here. Honey, why, why did you show up? Why wouldn't I be here? She's my daughter, after all. You're not my mother. You killed my mother. Honey, just give us the chance to start over, okay? We could start all this again. Give us a second chance. We could raise you. We can get you to the point where you're making life choices like this, but under our supervision, okay? We've lived a longer life than you. I mean, where are you even getting all this tuition money? Well, I, I don't know what you're mean about tuition. I kind of just showed up and started going to classes. That doesn't make any sense. They wouldn't just let anybody come here and start taking classes. That would be like trespassing. You need to be accepted. Well, what about you? I mean, you're trespassing. And you're not accepted. Yeah, but the camera is my ticket in. You could just show up with this thing anywhere and you're fine. Oh, good to know. Yeah, but that still doesn't answer the question. Who accepted you? On such short notice, too. Oh, that was easy. It was me. All I had to do was hack into Sheridan's database and kick someone out to make room for you. What? You kicked someone out? She was nowhere near as smart as Chucky. The poor girl. She was probably spending so much time studying, getting good grades. The program is much better having our daughter. But I don't understand. I thought you wouldn't want to see our daughter leave. I didn't at first. And then I realized that it was what was best for her. And I wanted to support her any way I could. I love you, Chucky. The whole point of me leaving and going to college was so you wouldn't interfere in my life. And now you did it anyway, and you kicked a girl out. I am done with this. I didn't think it would have to come to this, but... Whoa! What? Dude, is that Arjun? Hey, Arjun! You in there, buddy? It's not Arjun, it's my dad. Yeah, but last I checked, Arjun was in your dad's body. Pause, but... Well, I removed that idiot friend of yours. Rude. We didn't raise her to talk like this. We didn't raise our daughter to be so ungrateful. Well, guess what? I am. You're both just horrible people. Well, technically, I'm not a person. Well, you're a horrible robot being. There. What should we do, Mark? I think it'd be smart for you guys to defend yourself. You don't know what's coming. Um, what? Entering defensive mode. Do right when you did wrong. Huh? Chuckie, what are you up to right now? What the heck are those? Candles for a ritual. I think she's about to bring Chucky back to life. I don't foresee this going well for us, but then again, I beat him last time. Yeah, but maybe that was because Arjun was in his body and Arjun's like a wimp, you know? This is the actual Chucky. Might make a difference. Then we must do something. Hey, Dad. Ready? Be back in no time. Deus is machina. Give my dad the power. I beg of you. Um, no, no, it's uh, you don't have to do this. It's fine. Deus no, is no, no, machina. Uh, give my dad the power. I beg of you. Uh, this is not good. This is not good. At Deus is machina. Give my dad the power. I beg of you. Oh, 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 oh. Hi, your daughter. Dad, can't believe you're you're back. It's it's actually you. I can't believe I'm finally meeting my dad. Is it playtime? There was a reason I brought you back. Remember who killed you? Yeah, well, she pretended to be my mom. And now, she's trying to ruin my life. But I'm doing it motherly love. Last time, you're not my mom. So, Dad, can you help me? Sure, and I brought company. Hi, sweetie. Oh, oh my gosh, it's my mom. Daughter, you want us to take care of these guys for you? You take the boy. I want Megan. Okay, no problem, sweetie. I'll take care of the other one. This is gonna be fun. Let's do this. Hey guys, why are you looking at me? Look at Megan. She's the one that can fight. I'm not capable of this at all. All right. All right, fine. Oh, oh my 
my god, guys. That looked like it hurt. I am so sorry. Now you know how I feel. Uh-oh, someone's getting splashed them. Did I hear her say that we raised her well? Well, no. Bye, Chuck and E. <laughs> they grow up so fast. You know, this whole experience has just made me consider if I'm even ready to be a dad. I botched it. I think you are a great dad, Mark. Really? I need to make you something. Movie dad. Oh my god. You got a business mind. I should sell those. I have already put that on your merch website. That's wifey material right there, but how did you do that? I can do lots of things you don't know about. Yeah, that's actually something I wanted to talk to you about. Why are you keeping secrets from me? You submitted our daughter to this place without even letting me know. That's kind of a big decision, don't you think? I did what I thought was best for her. I know, but in a relationship, in a guardianship, you're supposed to decide with your partner. And you're leaving me out of these big decisions that I really would like to have some input on. And I think it's only fair. No offense, Mark. But we both know I am smarter than you. Yeah, I understand. But our daughter, well, not anymore, is really, really smart for her age. And she doesn't need the college experience at this age especially. She doesn't know what she's getting into. She was more than ready. She is not like a normal human. She grew a lot quicker. Yeah, but it's not all about intellect, okay? Like, emotions are important too. Something that you don't know anything about. I thought we had determined that I do have emotions. Well, I don't know. Like, if you were a human, you would probably be considered a sociopath. But Mark, isn't it obvious that I love you? I guess you show it in your own way, but I just... I don't know if this is gonna work anymore. Mark, are you breaking up with me? Um... <laughs> Oh, uh, what made you assume that? Whoa, 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 stand back, stand back. Whoa, take it easy. Use your words, not actions. <laughs> you crushed my movie dad bottle. You won't be needing that anyway. You're no longer a dad. And you're no longer my girlfriend, Megan. So you are breaking up with me. I think it's only right, okay? You should find another robot. But the robot dating pool is so small, Mark. Well, no, Siri, I heard, is single. I'm into men. I'm pretty sure you could change it to a man in the voice settings. That's just simple voice modulation. Huh, I can do it too. <laughs> Megan, this might have been the hardest thing I've ever had to do. I've been contemplating it for a while. Wait, what? Nothing, just ignore what I just said. But anyway, um, you will always have a special place in my human heart, and I will always cherish our time together. This reminds me of when we first met. Aw, that's cute. Why? Because I wanted to kill you. Oh. Killer mode activated. Um, Megan, Megan, it's okay. No, Megan, Megan, no. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm getting the hell out of here. I'm escaping Megan. Guys, don't forget to leave me a like and a comment. This is a shout out to someone who left a comment in the last video. I'm Megan Pool, and I know you are too!